The amount of money that we can make as entrepreneurs is directly related to the level of personalization that we give our clients and the prospects that we have. When you can give your, your prospects and your clients a highly personalized service, you're going to get more clients, you're going to build your business faster, and you're gonna get more clients faster. Seek out ways to present a more personalized experience because it's so important to do. For those of you who don't know me, it's Chris Prouty, and for the last 21 years, I have helped Help thousands of experts and entrepreneurs wildly grow their businesses by attracting more clients online. But I do it in a way that you might not think. If you're new to my channel, now would be a genius time to click that subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications so that you get alerts every time I create new content about attracting clients into your business. So I was reading some research today from Twillo and I was reading this fascinating survey about personalization in marketing. And I'm gonna share some of the statistics that were in that survey uh, and how they impacted me and how I look at personalization in my business. I'll share that with you in just a little bit. But before I get to that, if you are inspired to grow your business and you want to attract new clients into your business, I've set this up right here for you, proudyclass.com. All you have to do is go here and you can take an on-demand workshop that I made for you that's going to teach you a straightforward strategy that you can start using right away to attract clients into your business. So just go to proudyclass.com. I had so much fun recording that for you and you're gonna have a tremendous amount of fun taking it. And when you're in there, you'll have an opportunity to meet with me live and ask me questions. So uh, yeah, just go there, go to that URL and you'll, uh, you'll be able to get into that on-demand class. My clients come to me because they want to get more clients. They wanna get more clients for their own businesses. And they, while they have had some success in getting clients because they have a product or service that's phenomenal, they haven't had the impact that they wish to have. And so we change that by helping them create these personalized experiences for their prospects and ultimately for their clients. And I would love to share more information with you about that. You'll see, actually see that in this class. So when I was reading that Twillow survey uh, about personalization in marketing, they talked about three really important things. And one of them is a three-step process that you can start using right away. And I wanna share some of that data with you. The very first thing that they shared is that 62% of the people that they surveyed said that they would lose brand loyalty if that brand presented them with an unpersonalized experience. So let's really think about that for a second. 62% of your prospects or of your clients will lose their loyalty in you if you present them with an unpersonalized experience. And to really drive that point home, that's up 20% year over year. So that's a lot of people that you have the opportunity to impact if you can provide a personalized experience. Or, put another way, if you look at the experience that your prospects and your clients have, if it's unpersonalized, you can expect that many of these clients or prospects that you have are gonna to start to lose brand loyalty in you. And that's, we don't want that. We, we want people having that connection to us. We want those connected consumers. So you should be seeking out ways to personalize the experience that they have. One of the things that you can do is really get to know the wants, desires, fears that your clients and your prospects have. Like really get to know it, make it a part of your language. And once you get to know what your prospects truly want, what your clients truly want, then build that into deeply personal experiences that they have with you. That's gonna be different for every single one of you, but it's important to do. And you must find ways to deeply personalize the experience that your clients have with you and that your prospects have with you when they are exposed to you and your message. Look at what I'm doing right now as an example. I go live almost every single day and I produce training every day for you. You might be a prospect. You might be somebody who wants to come into my mentorship and that would be incredible if you did. And if you didn't, that would be cool too. 
but I'm creating content based on what I know about you, what I know about my clients, what I know about the prospects that I've had a chance to talk to. How do I know? I've got a notepad right here. And every time I'm in a call with a client or with a prospect, I'm taking a tremendous amount of notes so that I understand and I can personalize the things that I teach to you. And that's why I do this so much. So that is the beginnings of a deeply personalized experience. When you come into my mentorship, it gets even more personal. And if you'd like to see what it's like to be mentored by me, well, that's you just go right here, go to proudlyclass.com and take a free workshop that I recorded for you. And in that workshop, I'll give you an invitation to actually uh, spend live time with me to ask me questions. All right, so that workshop's here and that's what, that's what you're gonna do. Just go there and do that. So the third, the third component uh, that, uh, that really comes to the surface when we're talking about personalizing the experience for our prospects and for our clients is that there are, there's a three-step process that we should follow to personalize the experience that they have. The first, number one, you should be writing this down. Number one, listen. And I talked about that just a moment ago, but you should always be listening to what your prospects and what your clients are saying to you. That's why I have this notepad right here so that I can always write down the things that I hear. Because a lot of times a prospect will say something to me and I'll be like, oh, I, I haven't, I don't use that word in my own language, but I'm hearing it over and over again from my prospects. That's probably something that I can start using in my marketing, in my training, in the experience that these people have with me to make it more personalized for them. I have lots of different examples of that. So step number one, listen, write that down in your notes. Step number two, educate. Once you understand what your clients are looking for and what your prospects are looking for, you should be leading with education. If you'd like an example of that, go to my YouTube channel, look or go to any of my socials and look, everything I do is based on education. Education is so profoundly impactful because only the expert can educate. And if you're an expert, you're going to differentiate yourself from all of your competition and you're gonna create that personalized experience. The feedback that you're gonna get is gonna be phenomenal. I love it when I meet with a prospect and the first thing they say is, I've learned so much from you already. What's it like to even work with you? And it's because I lead with education. So you've listened, step one. Step two, you're educating. Step number three, engage. And by engaging, what I mean is synthesize what you've heard and what you can teach and create highly engaging content that your prospects are going to be magnetized to. Create engaging content that is personalized to the wants, the desires, the fears, the current situations of your clients and your prospects. And when you're able to engage with the content that you're creating, that is educational content based on what you heard, now you've got this beautiful synthesis of personalization in your marketing. And that is the most profound way that I can teach you to attract more clients to your business. All right, so remember 62% of people surveyed in this Twilo study, study said they would lose brand loyalty if that brand was unpersonalized. So start to personalize everything that you do and make it personal to your perfect client, to your perfect prospect. And if I had to give you one tip, it is to lead with education. Always be teaching, always be showing people the transformation that awaits them. By the way, if you would like to learn more than I can teach you in a very short video like this, I created this right here, proudyclass.com, which is an on-demand class that you can go take right now and one hour from now, you'll have a strategy that will start attracting new clients to you. I'm not kidding around about this. And while everything that I've just taught you is incredibly important, it might not be the only thing that you need, which is why I'm gonna put a link for a video right here for you to go check out so that you can learn even more about how to grow your business. And of course, if you click on my face, you can subscribe to my channel and get alerts every time I create new content just for you.